Peggy 18. The elite operators of the U.S. Special Operations community are tasked with only the most difficult and dangerous missions. The subject featured in the following interview operated within this community and acted as a consultant on the development of Medal of Honor. Their identity has been concealed for security purposes. I first became interested in joining the military uh, about six months after high school. I did four years with the Rangers, and I heard about this unit. What drove me to go into that unit was the challenge. Any tier one level unit or elite unit that operates at a high level, everybody's superstars in, in those units. It pushes you harder. I was a team breacher. The roles of a breacher are kind of complex. There's a lot of, a lot of energy in explosives and they're, they're very dangerous. Let me be honest with you. Everybody likes to blow stuff up. Your job is a lot more than just putting a, a charge on a door and just hitting the clacker and detonating the charge. You have to strike that balance between getting entry and safeguarding your team and also the hostages that are inside the buildings. And there's a lot of unknowns. That's always on the mind of the breacher is, did I make the right choice? I would always look at the missions to see what I was required to do, and I'd make modifications to my equipment. We were kind of on the tip of developing and making innovations. It all kind of comes together. War is the mother of invention. <laughs>